What up everybody? So I think it is time for another physique update. As I said, I will be doing this monthly. Whether or not I make great results or not so great results, whatever, I will always try to make sure I do a monthly physique update. And I think so I can make sure I keep it consistent and make sure it comes out at a consistent time. On the last Monday or Sunday of each month, I will record the video and I'll post it up in the following month. So like the, the beginning of the following month, just so I can make sure everything's consistent and the progress is recorded like four weeks in between, you know? So it kind of makes more sense when I'm showing you guys how much progress I've been making. So I did read some of you guys' comments and what I could add to the video to make it a bit more informative in terms of where how i'm progressing you know like adding in measurements and shit so i'll try to add in some measurements here and there and show you guys my weight i don't know if i showed you guys my weight last time i think i just posed just to let you guys see how i look so yeah uh let me do the weight first So this is how much I am weighing. I am weighing 164 as of today. So if you guys haven't watched my previous video, my powerlifting cows tank episode four video, I explained what I was doing while I was away. I was still bulking as in eating a lot of food. And I'm gonna be honest guys, most of that food, most of that weight is coming from them Big Macs I've been eating from McDonald's and them CYT, them Create Your Taste Burgers because I'm the chef, like I'm the CYT chef, so I know how to actually make the burgers myself and I do it and I, I stuff that shit with so many things and oh, it tastes so good. So yes, a lot of the way I put on is fat, which is why I told you guys in the previous update, I'm like, yo, I feel like I'm getting a little bit fluffy and my girl would always be telling me that my abs don't feel the same, they're not as tough or whatever one night she said it to me and i literally said like wait hold on i just stood up i just stepped on the weight scale and i was like 160 161 and that was like a few that was like two weeks ago or something so right now as of today uh, i am now 164 and it's funny because you know people always diss me saying oh, i never made progress i never actually gained weight because those times i wasn't consistent this time i remained consistent even when i wasn't recording myself because i said you know what eff it by the time I come back, I still want to show you guys that I'm making progress, and I am making some type of progress. I don't feel as lean, but of course, you know, you guys view me differently. To me, I don't feel as lean, but I want to see what you guys think. So here is my physique. So here's the front, right? The front. I don't know how to pose, guys. So like, you have to bear with me. I do not know how to pose. Okay. So there's my front. I don't know if I'm looking that much bigger. Here's my side, my right side. Here's my left side. I do not know how to do a lat flare. A lat, like I don't know how to flare my lats at all. Like shit. I don't know how to flare my lats at all. <laughs> I know it was pretty shit, but you have to bear with me. Here are my legs. Actually, no, let me lower the camera a little bit. Show my legs. There's that. And then there's my left leg. Again, I don't feel that lean in my legs at all. So yeah, my leanness, I personally don't feel like it's there as much. I feel like to really show my abs, I have to flex a, a lot harder than I had to before. Especially if you look at me, my five month calisthenics progress. I look a little, bit, a little bit smaller, but damn, I was lean. Like, holy shit, I was lean. Now it's just like, ah. So anyways, let me show you guys the measurements, my arm measurement and should I do leg measurements like for a thigh? Uh, fine, I'll, I'll do the leg measurement too. So someone told me that I should do my arm measurements in a flex position. I always used to do it in a relaxed arm position, just hanging down. But people, I guess, would rather see it flexed. So let me just start doing it in a flex position anyway. I don't know. I, I'll just do it. I'll just do it for you guys. So let me try to find the thickest part. Would that be good, guys? I think that's good right there. Okay. Let's see. So 
<clears throat> 13 inches, 13 inches flexed for my right arm, right? If you guys want to see it. Um, focus, bro. Focus. Let me try to focus this. Okay. You see that? 13 inches. I think that's pretty good. Okay, right there. This one, 13 inches. Same thing. 13 inches. Uh, it's not focusing properly, but yeah, 13 inches for both arms. Let's do the legs now. I pretty much go like this with one arm, with one hand, and I go like this with the other hand. So I can pretty much find the center by doing this, right? That's my way of finding the center of my thigh, the best way possible, and that's how I'm always going to be measuring my thigh. And right now, my thigh is 19.5 inches, okay? So 19.5 inches is my thigh measurement. Sorry, it's upside down. This makes more sense. 19.5 inches for my right thigh, and for my left thigh, let's see if I can do the same thing. Right there, right there. Around. Okay. Again, same thing. 19.5 inches, okay, right here, 19.5 inches. I feel like my abs are still pretty there. My physique isn't bad, right? My physique isn't bad as I'm a little bit bigger. Like technically, really, I'm 14 pounds heavier than you guys usually see me, because usually I was around like, usually I was around 150, but this is me at 164, right? 13, po 13 inch biceps or 13 inch arms. 40, was it 39 inches? Nine, what? 39 inches for my legs, right? I can't do my chest measurement yet. I think I'm gonna get my girl to do my chest measurement in the next video, my next physique update. But anyway, that is how my physique is looking right now. I'm a little bit bigger, you guys have been noticing. Uh, and yeah, I've been putting in that work while I was away. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the physique update. I'll try to make sure it comes out every single month. And yeah, I'll continue to make progress. And hopefully I could hit that 170 by the middle of July. That would be amazing if I get that 170 and still be lean. Because the other thing too is that some of my shirts I used to wear, you guys remember those sweaters I would always wear uh, with the little hoodies and shit? Yeah, the arms are getting pretty tight now. Like it almost, like it's not fitting me anymore, which is kind of, annoying but what can you do that's what happens when you're making gains oh god oh <laughs> hodge twins anyway i'm out of here guys stay blessed and i am done